Yes guys, we've got a package here sent from EA. We're gonna unbox it right here with you guys. We've got a sneaky feeling that it's gonna be something to do with FIFA Ultimate Team. Without further ado, I think we need to just open the box and get down to it. Oh! And now I've seen a couple of videos on this and I am excited! Me too, me too. You guys know where we're going with this figure. Yes! Right, let's have a look. We don't need this anymore, do we? No, throw that. Okay, so EA have sent this through. It's a little bit lovely. Now we're in a privileged position, Jez. We are. To receive this box. I'm going to slide it open. Hold this here. Mm. Oh, See oh, how I done that. Oh, See mate. how I done that. Now I've seen your YouTube videos when you've been struggling to open that. I just sort of <laughs> swifted that. <laughs> hey, you just slipped it out like it was sliding into some DMs, bro. Mate. So. Oh yes. So they've broken it up into positions: defenders, midfielders, attackers, and goalkeepers. We have to choose our FIFA Ultimate Team of the Year. And we're privileged because it will go um, towards the vote of the FIFA Ultimate Team of the Year. So, without further ado, what we've got here is the um, the pitch. Cheeky metallic pitch. Nice. Hold on. <laughs> yeah, that's magnetic. Well, ask no questions, tell no lies. So it comes with a little letter from EA. Congratulations, you are one of the few selected to represent the millions of FIFA players all over the world. With a vote in our most prestigious campaign, FUT Team of the Year. Your ballot is part of a collective of votes from community members which will account for 60% of the total vote. To ensure your vote counts, please follow the three steps outlined below. Number one, create. Of the 55 players provided in your ballot box, determine who should represent the final team? Engage your community, debate, discuss, create, and determine your 11. Once you've determined your 11, use the team of the year items to represent your squad on the magnetic pitch. The team must be in a 4-3-3 formation. Oh, so we're doing this together. Let's do it. Right. See, I just flip that like I mean business. Like, <laughs> watch this. That one very. Let's go. So, there's 55 players in here, and we can only pick 11. Four different sections, goalkeepers, defenders, midfielders, attackers. Okay, so first up, we have got goalkeepers. Oh yes. Whew. Now, I've got a feeling you're gonna be favoring your man, Hugo. Mm, I'm not, mate. Um, unbelievable keeper, I love him to bits, but you're going to favour Buffon, but I'm thinking De Gea. I am thinking De Gea. Got to be De Gea. Put him in, Jez. We we're, we're agreed on that. Come in. Take him out. This is the first one. De Gea, hang on, mate. One second. Now, listen, mate. You've done well. You've produced over this last year. And for that reason, mate, <laughs> you're in. Right. Look how buzzing he is. Hey, let's look. look at how buzzing this guy is. Out of respect, because we're very respectful, the players that didn't quite get selected, we're going to send them off with closure. Closure. So come in. Oh, it's magnetic. It oh. is magnetic. Turn it upside down, Jez. The hair, you ain't going nowhere, bruv. You're in the team of the year. That's the way, that's the way it is, gonna stay like that, yes. Oh, I'm gonna put this on here. Right, we gotta talk about this, because it's just an abundance of ballers right here. All right, I'm gonna throw this out there straight away. Sergio Ramos, I think that he makes it into my side for sure. What are you saying, you happy with Sergio? I am, I don't... Um... It's competitive, isn't it? Yeah, it's tough, mate. This is, this is a tough one. What you've got to look at is, Giza's won the Champions League. Throw him in, it's just Sergio Ramos. Half no questions, tell no lies. He's going in at centre back. Sergio, congratulations. Welcome to the team. Thiago at centre back. I'm happy with that. Do you know what? This ain't, this ain't easy, is it? It's not easy. Let's 
go Thiago because we're going with Marcelo at left back and that's two Brazilians, that's oh, a link. Put them next to each other, that's right? A, that's a link. Look yeah. at the romance between them two. Oh my giddy giddy giddy. You see where we're going with that? Well, this is FIFA, baby. This is FIFA. Mate, we, we, do you put Jordi Alba at right back and then we pair them two up? That's Wait. what I'm saying. Oh. But he's a left back, he's a left back, so we don't. Do you know what? This is controversial. But I would I would consider Walker, yeah. Oh, Alves, mate, stick him in, stick him in. I didn't even see him there. No. <laughs> Let's just pretend you never said that. <laughs> now, to be fair, the world's most expensive right back, Carl Walker, is a good choice. However, Danny Alves has been there, he's done it, and he's got bags of experience, and he's still producing. So, Danny Alves, you're in. Guys, you've done well to get this far, but unfortunately, this isn't your season. <laughs> Next up, midfielders. Oh my gosh, this is this is this is so tough. Wow. For me, this is like uh, Modric, Iniesta, De Bruyne has gotta be in there. Does Deli Ali get in there? Modric or Iniesta, one of them has to go in. I think De Bruyne, De Bruyne has got to be a no-brainer. Yeah, De Bruyne. Right. De Bruyne. Go on, Kev. Go on, Kev. Oh, left or right? Mate, it doesn't matter. Put him on the right. Oh, he's in. Do we go with Luka Modric or Iniesta? For me, Luka. But Luka's slightly more attacking, isn't he? Oh, Kante. Should we stick Kante there, then? Yeah. Kante, you go in there, but really, we'll put you about there. Nice. Okay. I'm going to narrow this down. Don't know what you guys at home think, but I think this, come, clo come close in, Ben. I think this is between this man, this man. I can't leave him out. The only thing is he's been playing, he hasn't been playing 90 minutes lately. He, he plays like 60 and comes off. I'm not going to say Isco. Mate, do you know what? I am. I'm going to put him, him there and him there. Mate, I, I'm sorry to say it, I'm taking Luka Modric and I'm throwing him straight in that position if that was me. Do you know what? I, I would choose Deli Ali because unbelievable, but Luka Modric winning the Champions League, playing like he has been playing, you can't not put him in the team, Jez. He's the best midfielder in the world, isn't he? Yeah, put him, put, put him, put him in there. Put him in there, let's move on to the strikers. What a team! Yes, also we got a strong Real Madrid connection in our, in our team. Ramos, Marcelo, Modric, got a lot of Brazilians. We're doing well, there's a lot of connections. We got a couple of Spanish. Mate, we are doing well, we're thinking, we're thinking about this. Right then, on to the attackers, here we go. Actually, I didn't pull out of much elegance, did I? Let me, do, let me do that again, I'm sorry. That, that didn't do the attackers justice. Ready? That was smooth. Okay, and then we put, oh my God. Wow. Where do we go from here? I'll put Messi in there, I'll put Ronaldo in there, I'll put Mbappe in there, I'll put, oh my God. Oh. What do you do? I don't know what to do. All right, let's narrow it. Let's try and start narrowing it. So it's gonna be out of, him. Does Coutinho get in there? Him. Neymar. Him. Help me out here, Bill, because I'm even. He even deserves to be in, Mate, in the running. Mate, Kane should be in there. Suarez. Suarez it has to, he has to be an option. Even Lewandowski's got to be an option. Friesman. Oh, I'll stick him in as an option. This is tough. I think we've got to. I think we've got to shake it up and just pick out of the hat for this one. I, 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 we're picking one player though, aren't we? Because we know we're picking Messi and Ronaldo. Or are we? <laughs> <laughs> I would go Messi, Ronaldo and Harry Kane. He deserves Ooh. it, man. Right. He deserves it. I'm not going to argue with Come you on. with Messi and Ronaldo. Listen, just because he's not like a Real Madrid player or Barca player or... Yeah, but I'm talking about Harry Kane up top though, Jez. He has to be central. Mate, I'm f You're not having Harry Kane, are you? Well, we di we're divided we on this. Over this. We're divided on this because... Go on. No Harry Kane, no whatever. 
Right, I'm gonna put it out there, Bill. I'm gonna, I think it should be Neymar. So we've narrowed it down to these four players. We know Messi and Ronaldo are keeping their spots. It's just about these two. Now there's no right or wrong answer here in my opinion. Bill, we've got to do this. We've got to just pick out my hand. Who is it going to be? Ronaldo, you're giving Kane a lot there. This is Neymar. I'm only going on performances and Harry going Kane the last year, just right? deserves to be in there. He's broken records. He's proving it in big games. Let's get some help from the F2 fan. I'm thinking... They're gonna say Neymar though. Neymar it is. They're gonna say Neymar. It's Neymar, isn't it? How could you leave Neymar out of the team of the year? You can't you can't leave him out. Messi likes to drop in, doesn't he? So maybe he goes here. You can put them any way you like, mate. It doesn't really matter. I would do it like that. That was really hard, man. That was super tough. That's our foot 18 team of the year. Guys, what's your team of the year? Put it in the comment section below. That wasn't easy. If you look at the choices of the players you've got, anyone in players deserve to be in that team, but... It was really tough. It was tough, it was tough. There's only one last thing that we need to do, and that is put the attackers back in the box. You're not even gonna put them back into their nut. No. You're gonna slide them back in. Well, they've got a bit of superiority within... Yeah. The non selected they're, they're, they're the low subs, isn't they? They're the 12, 12, yeah. 13 and 14. Yeah. You know, when you're 16 or 17, you ain't getting no, nothing. Yeah. 14. They've made the squad, really, haven't they? They've made the squad. Yeah. <laughs> so that's it. Let's hold it up. It's a little bit wet. <laughs> there you go. That is our FIFA Ultimate Team of the Year. What do you guys think? There's all sorts of bits. It's because our team would do bits. But what do you guys think? Do you agree with our team? Do you think that there's some players that we could have chosen differently. Let us know in the comments section below. Until next time, love, peace, and techies.